we've traveled together to some interesting conferences and heard that, you know, exercise really is medicine and food is, it can be medicine too. I mean, it's really important to consider those things. What are, you know, you're, you've been a physical therapist focusing on MS for many years now. What's, what are the inspirational stories that you can use to help motivate people that it's important to you know, stay active? I've also seen patients who have said that they are healthier now with their MS because they take care of their bodies. They are involved in an exercise routine. They watch what they eat. I, I'm a big proponent of aquatic activities. I don't want to say necessarily swimming because you don't have to be a good swimmer and you don't have to do laps, but the water is fantastic for people with MS. It lowers your core body temperature. You're much more buoyant. It can help with decreasing swelling from, from the um, hydrostatic pressure. Um, but one woman said that she wishes she could live her life on a daily basis in about three feet of water, like up to her waist or um, mid chest, because she was upright, she was mobile, she could move around. And, and of course, that's not possible. But just that image always stuck in my head. And I, I use it when I try and um, sing the praises of aquatic activity. 